What is blockchain? Blockchain is the decentralized ledger of all transactions across a peer-to-peer -peer network. Wait, what? Okay, let's take a step back. How does an online transaction work mechanically? So you go on Amazon, you find a product you like, then you enter your credit card information and you checked out. On the back end of this simple online checked out process, there are quite a few parties involved in this transaction. First, you give your credit card's information to Amazon. Amazon would send authorization requests to the payment processing networks like MasterCards, Visa, or American Express. These payment processing networks would ask your bank for their approval to see if you have enough money or credit limit in your banks. Once your bank is done confirming that you have money, the transaction's validation goes all the way back to Amazon. Amazon would give you order receipt and your banks will send you your credit card statement. Every parties involved in this transaction would have their own version of the transaction record as well that will look different than yours. Before blockchain, these data and records would often store in data tables. Think of it like a boring, long Excel spreadsheet. Ledgers just mean these records in spreadsheet format. And centralized just mean that the companies control their own ledgers. So what we got before is, data table is a centralized ledger of all transactions across a lot of middlemen. This is where blocks come in. A block is not a data table. A block is just a different ways to secure and store data. A block can contain any relevant data information about a transaction, like buyer, seller, the amount pay, the product order, or the date of the transaction. A hash is a unique identity of the block. You can compare this to your most unique, secure, encrypted biometric which is almost impossible to fake. The last element of the block is the previous hash. Previous hash creates the chain to connect the block to the previous block hash that contains previous record. This makes blockchain very secure because it's extremely difficult to fake the identity of the block. Even when you manage to hack the hash, your blockchain will break because you would have to change all the hash before and after that block as well. Now to make blockchain even more secure, blockchain use a peer-to-peer -peer network where everyone can have the same copy of the blockchain. These peers in the network act as an agent or node monitoring the activities on the blockchain. If there's a new block trying to be added to the chain, everyone in the network will have to verify whether or not this block is valid. And that's Monkey Go for today. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next video.